Welcome guys to Dex Trading Vision. We are coming with an update for the DeFi chain trade website. Most of you are probably well aware of um, this tool and what it can do and help you exploring the DeFi chain. Um, but we have brought a major update with some exciting new features and it's going to be a game changer especially for the active traders. So um, let's get right into it and uh, stay tuned. We will just start with a little bit of recap of uh, what we have so far. So let's go into the short recap and um, here we are in the explore tab and here you can basically analyze every trade that's been made on uh, the DEX. So you can drill down, um, you can search, you can uh, narrow down the dollar volume, you can search by date, you can search sold for, bought with or both, you can search for pool swaps or pool liquidity or loans and you can also search from specific addresses you know. And um, yeah, there are a lot of tools and you can also set alerts here, telegram alerts with this feature, this button here. So you can make a notification, for example, for yourself, for your own account, when you don't want to wait um, when the block has been minted. Sometimes it takes rather long, so um, you set a telegram alert and when your trade is through, you will get a notification via telegram on your phone or on your apple watch or wherever you get it and um, then you know the, the trade is done and you don't have to be glued to your phone or your screen all the time so this um, is a big help but you can also do the telegram alerts for um, basically any account that you want to follow so that's that's a big help um, then we have the quick graph which um, allows you to see um, the relevant prices and uh, price development in uh, all the different assets. So I don't have to go through. Um, this is self-explanatory. And then the mempool, yes. So the mempool is um, like a TV for a lot of active traders. So you can see what's, what's really happening, um, what pool swaps are happening and um, whatever you want to see. I mean, um, there is also a filter so um, I have been hiding a lot um, things I'm not really that interested. So it will not clutter um, my mempool. I just want to focus on pool swaps and um, want to see if somebody is taking a loan so you can anticipate what's, what's going to happen. Then um, we had auctions. At the moment, luckily, there are no auctions, but um, this is also quite uh, good help if you want to uh, participate in an auction so you will get some um, idea here what is the uh, limit price you should go for but um, for most people auctions is not really um, that interesting it's mostly been used by bots and um, yeah so what else did we have account of course so um, here you have two sub um, tabs, which is one is swap, swaps where you can um, enter certain target prices for certain assets. And then addresses is where you can basically follow um, certain addresses, your own addresses or addresses you are interested in. And um, when you have done that, then um, you can follow this address in Explorer from the scroll down menu. And then of course uh, Dex Trading Masters where you can follow every trader. You can see um, what they currently trading. Um, you can see the transactions they did. And um, yeah, it's quite a nice tool to follow the action live. And um, there's been a lot of action this time around. So um, it's quite, quite a tough environment. You can also click on live and you see all the, the recent uh, activity. So um, all the trades that have been happening 
not so many because Easter weekend is a little bit quiet. And you can also uh, dive into the history so you can see all the past editions, um, all the past five text trading masters, see um, the gains and um, who, who won, who lost. But actually nobody really loses in this event. So um, if you don't manage to win some DUSD, you at least gain experience. So, and now let's dive into the additions, the new stuff that um, we made. And in the mempool, you can now see the latest block up here in the left. And um, you can also um, catch now all data in one block, even you reload or just enter the mempool, um, so you will always see uh, the post record. So that is quite helpful because in the past it was like you reload uh, the mempool um, when your computer lost the connection and then you will only see from this point forward. But now it will show you the trades that have been made already in that same block. Yeah, and now it gets really interesting. So. Um, you can see this tab here, pools, that is brand new and it will allow you to see um, all the assets um, and you can basically um, add favorites, you can sort by different means and it is uh, similar to some tools that we had already in, on, on the web but um, this is now an integrated uh, and improved version so um, you have basically the possibility to um, favorite some of your um, most traded uh, tokens so you just click on the star and um, it will add or delete it from your list and you can sort by pool size you will see the biggest pools um, so it's ranked first by your favorites <clears throat> and then all the others but um, you can also sort it by dex price so you will basically see um, the ones with the highest premium first and now you can see that there is a trade actually happening on MicroStrategy. Somebody is buying MicroStrategy, which um, will increase the price from 1808 to 1811. So that is a very useful uh, feature. So you see exactly and immediately what's uh, happening and what is the price impact. And um, you can act on this and place a trade. So but there is more to this one, so you can, as I did here, you can um, select hide the small pools. Um, the small pools with uh, very low volume I am hiding because I'm not using them regularly to trade. And uh, so this gives you a better um, overview. But um, you can uncheck this one and then you will, ha you will have all existing D tokens, assets, and you can rank them the way you want and you will see the ones with uh, the highest discount up to the ones with um, the highest premium. And then there is also the detailed view. So um, some people might be interested um, in a little more data and uh, we have different uh, Oracle prices. So you will see the active, the next and the latest Oracle prices. And um, also here, when there is a live trade happening, it will show. So um, you basically have the choice. Um, you can sort it and tailor make it the way you want it. And um, we think that's, that's pretty cool and pretty helpful. We are coming to notifications, which is probably the most awaited and coolest tool that we have now implemented. Now you can get price alerts, uh, you can tailor make your price alerts, so you will be notified with a telegram message whenever your target price is hit, or not even target prices, but uh, you can also specify certain percent ranges for the mempool shift, and um, that's what I'm using a lot. So you just select what you want, 
mempool shift for example, then um, you type the name of the asset, select the token, and then you just specify the percent range you um, you are interested in. For example, if BT rises by 0.5 percent, you want to be notified. So you just enter here 0.5 percent, and um, you will always get a notification when the price in the mempool is going to move 0.5 percent up or down, and um, so you have a notification, you can act on that, you can place a trade. Um, or you can just simply say, um, I want to specify a certain target price I have in mind. And with that, you just enter the BT price you want here. For example, $7. And um, then you click Submit Notification. And you will see here in Telegram, notification will be sent here. So you just click and then it will open the Telegram page, which should bring you to the app. So open Telegram and um, you see now active BT user commands list. Yeah, so that's one powerful addition which can help you track um, your target prices and um, be notified of pool swaps that you think are important where you want to enter trade. And um, yeah, so just try it out and um, give us some feedback. This is not the end of the road. We have uh, a lot of other cool things in store and we will continue to improve this tool. So uh, stay tuned. And um, one final note, if you like this website, if you use it, and if you profit from it, then please consider to click the link here and um, donate a little bit from your profits. So that will help Sasha, who is uh, working on that in his free time, to uh, continue get going and uh, make this tool even better. Thanks a lot. See you next time.